item catch, sometimes he'll just catch it and immediately drop it. It looks really cool when he does it. Or he'll throw it back, you know. There it is right there. There's First the thing he did, pull First out a turret and actually hit Music King in the face with it. The, it's like, uh, it's the like eight prince. seconds into the match, and he's, he's pulled four turnips, which is... Yeah. Yeah, what were you saying? Well, I was just going to remark on how Mart's like, you know, the prince of the Fire Emblem universe getting hit in the face by a turnip <laughs> from the Mushroom Kingdom. But also a royal turnip, right? Yes, it's absolutely. Not, yeah, not, yeah, not yeah, a not, not a turnip. Nope. We've got a... This, this is was a harvested royal battle. by, yeah, the royal, you know, gardeners. Right. Well, the princess herself, really. It's a prince and princess battle. That's true. Who will win? Who this will is win. war. Okay, this is two kingdoms rising up. How have we never made this reference? Beyond oh, me. You think spacing outside the down smash. Wow, I actually can't believe that, that up air. Well, I guess I can. All right. You wow, great there? forward air there to bat the turnip away. Yeah, he's got to do that. Yeah, so many. Wow, did you see that I, grab? I did. 2.5x as large as Fox's grab. <laughs> That's something that uh, Fox players say after. Yeah. A Fox player, a two shall not be. He's going to make it back to oh forward my smash! God. A Mutual King, I don't get it. Someone explain to me why he doesn't forward smash because you know that Armada can outspace that. He's done it a million times. I know it doesn't look like it, but I swear to God he can do it. Just forward smash him. Oh my God. <laughs> do you know what I mean? I do know what you mean. Like, you down tilt does not work. I've never seen anyone down tilt. I swear I've never seen it happen. Just because it's anyway. Armada. Just because it's Armada. Oh my God. All right, well, Mutual King with the first dog anyway. I hear what you're saying. Let's see how. Let's see how it pans out. You know what I'm saying? Oh, what a dash attack! We've got a lot of melee in front of us. That's true. Dash attack. Uh, Tope and I were actually talking about it before this game. Wow. By the way, up air from Peach, one of my favorite moves. Just kicks him with the stiletto. Yeah. See you later. Wait, you're talking about Mars dash. Mars dash attack. Right? So so it is just, Peach. Is so it's really good. They're both really for good. different reasons. For different reasons, right? Mars he just lunges so far forward, way further forward than it looks like he should, and it's like this. Uh. If any of you guys are coming in Street Fighter V, you remember Nash's dash and how dumb it was and how you can't really react to the animation. Well, in that game, it was because of you know, the seven frames of lag, but it, similar effect where it, it, you feel like you should be able to react, but guess what? You it's can. way harder, way, way, way harder. Whoa! Than you. you basically have to anticipate it. Armada now with some offense. Oh, beautiful get up attack. And Armada with amazing spacing, like able to just get Mewtwo King in a panic. He spot dodge and then upbeat. Yeah. Which is like, honestly, those are like two super unpanicky nervous moves. By the way, you saw there Armada actually power shielded the get up attack. The best player in the world with one of the best reactions in the world, basically just framing uh, the sorry not the get up, but the dash tag from Mars. Yeah, he's Armada. So, yeah, yeah. You're a, you're a, if you can react to Mars dash tag, even like just frame, uh, you're a top player. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's how I. Oh my god! Really sick from Yuji King so far. That's the second grab that I saw him get, which was like. Honestly, like the farthest possible Marth grab range hitbox. Uh, so he's surprising Armada with the grab range of Marth. Uh, oh, that's an edge guard. You know what else yeah. I'm seeing too? Uh, outside of that, Mewtwo King's actually doing a, a, overall a very good job recovering. He's not. I was gonna say that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Peach not really good again. I know. You know, we talk about Mewtwo King and his edge guard game a lot, but it's not gonna happen as much with. But but Armada. He can gimp Marts. And the fact that Mewtwo King is generally avoiding those yeah. games and those edge guards is, is, is good. Mewtwo King even, a lot even of recovering damage. at like higher KO percents is, is Mewtwo King right now, which is very impressive. Not yeah. not only not not only avoiding getting gimp, but right. overall being able to get back to the stage. As we say that, uh, does he his, even have a jump? I'm his not jump sure. Is yeah. Armada. As we say that. Yeah, that is exactly what that looks like when he hits that edge guard. He it's almost like he traded an air with a double jump. He just put it right there in front of Mewtwo King. So yeah, despite being uh, despite being down basically the whole game, Armada is back up. But wow. that fourth throw, how did he convert that into a tipper? Yeah, I don't he even did know. that two stocks in a row where he waved it. He doesn't. So Mewtwo King uh, famously well, does not want to learn the pivot tipper. He doesn't think it's reliable. He doesn't think he can do it consistently. So he's doing the old school wave dash forward tipper, but it's actually working because Armada's jumping. But right now, Mewtwo King with no jump, is he dead? Yes, he is. He uh, man, Mewtwo King, that whole stock just looked a little bit like you know he couldn't quite get his movement right. It it was like the tiniest bit of blood in the water, and Armada the shark yeah. just appeared right behind him and grabbed him and pulled him down. The sweetest shark. Mewtwo King already. He played every other stock brilliantly, but then that last stock he just kind of got trashed. Yeah, that's rough. Now to dreams is the counter pick. And I'll say once again, this is winners semis. Yeah, winners Which semifinals. means that we are still in two out of three territory. Yep. Armada versus Mewtwo King, game two. 
overall, quite a close game. Uh, but Armana, man, you give him one good bounce, and uh, he converts so hard off of everything. Yeah, absolutely. Good reaction Ooh, by me. Yeah. Or not even reaction, right? It's like he, he did the down tilt to cover the normal game. Oh, that was so God. smart. I was just thinking, like, yeah, I'll probably forward air. I'm not sure how he's going to follow up, but no. Just dunks him. Excellent recognition. Because that's a. Yeah, he dumpstered him. Remember he that? Did. He dumpstered him. Remember when you say that? Yes, I remember. Why did we stop saying that? Uh, let's bring it back. It's brought. It's brought back. All right, well, sick. But uh, that was definitely an instance of excellent recognition and improv by uh, Mewtwo King. Improv, That's not like a situation that, that you're going to see often in Melee. You know, Peach turn, uh, you know, in any character in, like, you know, recovery frames off of the stage. Yeah. But Mewtwo King is, like, as fast as humanly possible acknowledging it and choosing the exact right option. Yeah, for sure. And the Toad, too, right? Not a very common move. Peach saying, look at my good Toad. Oh! Again, you know, dash dance grab. Very difficult to do against Armada. You see Marth, you see Marth pushing his hair back? I absolutely That was did. so... That's that's like the Marth, that's this... Uh... Like, like the characters in this game have so much character, right? That's Marth, like, eh, you know, whatever. whatever. Top tier. Yeah, I'm top tier. He's gonna have to do something about this uh, stitch face, though. Oh, there! Okay, I thought, I was hoping yeah. he'd catch it. I think it was a little too risky. I think he made the right decision. Plus, he's up. Oh, no! Roll down smash, I was going to say, don't let Armada in, please. <laughs> Some tactics will always be good. Roll in, down smash. You know, highest level of play in 2017 and roll down smash. We're seeing. Wow. That was really ballsy by Beauty King. Armada landed on that platform on Fountain. Uh, I feel and like down tilted. He didn't down smash. If he down smashed, that was going to be a big problem for Beauty King. Yeah, but lots of damage. Lots and lots and lots of damage. He got the Utta, but I think he meant to land on the... Oh, ledge cancel. Don't know if he meant to do that. A little bit of a scuffle right now. And Armada floating at the perfect height. He's such a legend! Yeah, below the platforms. That's where the... It's going to be tied. Yeah, it yeah. is going to be tied. That's where the Fountain of, the Fountain of Dreams platforms and how they... You see them, they have variable heights. And when they're low like that, they're actually really, really nice for just when your opponent's on the platform above you. Especially for Peach. Did you see that fake Tomahawk, by the way, uh, from Mewtwo King? That was so sick. Where he, he actually... He empty landed. Uh, and then he like threw out an aerial, so it's like you know you you think that I yeah. I know that you know that you can react to this, so I'm not actually gonna go for the grab. I'm gonna go for something else. Yeah. Really awesome yeah. by Mewtwo King, giving the exact amount of respect that he should to the warrior, the legend Armada. Yeah, he's not the warrior because of Kage. Yeah, yeah, that's sorry warrior. Kage, but he's a ledge. He's a ledge. He's a ledge. Oh my God. Uh oh. No four B juice. Yeah. Oh. Is that another stitch. He just like Mewtwo King just invincible ledge dash. Teleported dashed. through it. Yeah, through the through the the, the stitch face. Good thing he practices ledge dashes. Uh huh. All right. I you know I would love to see a game three. I'm just gonna say it. I Me feel too. like it's kind of a cliche commentator thing to say, but man, I would actually authentically love to Wait. see a game three. Is he dead? No. Fountain very very high uh, blast box on the off the top. Man, and the grinder grinding through Mewtwo King's shield does get that hit. Uh, Armada grabs a turn again. I don't know if that, you know, slant, it's not a slant, it's like a not impressed face emoji turn -up. I don't know if that has any special properties. Stitch face is not the only turn -up that, uh, you know, is, is more powerful, but it's, you know, to another level. Right. In case you have no idea what's going on with these turnips, there is an RNG element. Yeah, I know. I know. There's that down tilt again. Oh my god, please retweet. <laughs> Wait, what? Who's re- I'll explain later. All right. Q. Mewtwo King up, uh, but I think that last game he was up by even more. Whoa. I think you, oh, he's a little low. I sure he got low, low. That Nair was not, I don't think he was looking for that Nair. Maybe he meant to grab the turnip, because if you hit the oh, grab button, uh, Z, yeah, yeah it, it, it reads an A input pretty much. If uh -oh. there's a turn up on top of you, it will grab it. If there's not, you will do a, like a neutral air, basically. Or, Dash attack is opened up. Yeah, this could be no big. jump. No jump from Ramada. Oh, that float. Yeah, Mewtwo King wanted to capitalize on it, so he went for the four B to keep himself like vertically. Oh, that down smash. Yeah, there's another one. There it is. Yeah. He didn't quite have the frames to get out of the way. You see the clutchness from Ramada to tech that down air too. Yeah. 
Well, that could have been a big juicy combo from Mewtwo King. Here you go. Got, like the double dump. Mewtwo King getting impatient, by the way. He just jumped in with a nair from like, you know, way too far away and then just ran up forward smash. It did work, but I do worry, you know, Armada, not the kind of guy who's going to get impatient like that. So right. and another forward smash that Mewtwo King thrown out. He's swinging. He is swinging. He's swinging for sure. Oh, he he's turned. The... He went from dasher to swinger. Yep. As Tope and I just go. Oh, oh. Armada with a setup. No, but he. Is that a tech error? I don't know. I kind of expected down smash or something. He's going to get wave dash forward smash attempt. Armada gets out. He might be dead. Big forward tilt. Wow. Tournament winner from Armada. Uncharacteristic. And he slumped back in his chair saying, man, I really didn't want to play this guy in another game. Oh, Butch King taking a moment. I love this. What's the think? What's the, how do you type in the thinking emoji? Uh, I don't that one's know. taken off, man. How did the, I think if you were buying and trading stocks based on emoji, yeah. if you invested in thinking face, you early, know, you know what stocks went up, went up pretty, is that man. one right there. You see that? No. See that over the bo bottom right corner of the screen? Look at that. Look at that guy right there. I don't know. There's what I'm a guy at. right there. I mean, I I see it because you're pointing, but the audience doesn't know what it is. Is that's it the, the hat? No, that's that's Ben S W. Oh, that is Ben S W. Ben S W. Right there. He's looking yeah, down. Yeah, I can see him. Looks he looks like, like he has a fedora on. No, he's just got big poofy Ready. hair that he runs his hands through to say not like this. That's the face of not like this, by the way. That happened exactly two years ago at EVO 2015 when Hugs threw against P uh, PMD. Big damage. Game three on Pokemon Stadium. Yeah, yeah I'm this, surprised this by is, this pick. What do you think? No, this is a really good stage for Mark, I think. It's, it's... I wonder if he was trying to bait the Fox out. Oh, interesting. Music yeah. King will switch characters. You know, I think sometimes he looks at the matchup and like he runs it through his algorithm. And you know, Fox Peach who probably has like really heavy weight towards it, so you never know if his if his computer reading is gonna right. cough out, oh you need to switch characters even maybe, though you maybe won that's every what that little, game in the set. That little thinking finger, maybe that's what that was. was <laughs> maybe he, maybe for the first time ever he was uh he was like vetoing the results of the algorithm. He was like, yeah, wait a yeah, minute, yeah. this actually doesn't make that much sense. Hang on, my human brain is, <laughs> my human brain is kicking in. Right. <laughs> I understand your calculations, but wait one second. I'm actually playing pretty well with Marth. Yeah, I, well, I hope that's what happened because I... I that would be a new era right for Mewtwo King. It would. If Human he knows how to discuss things with his computer brain. Right. And Mewtwo King up a stock versus Armada, the universal favorite to win this tournament, but it's a sword fight! All right, Rock Stage comes out. Armada probably, if he... He's keeping the sword. He is actually keeping the sword, but I feel like he's keeping it because it's such a good throw weapon. Okay. Yeah, he because never there's actually... only a few moves that actually utilize it. Dash attack, uh, tilt, jab, uh, and forward smash. Look at That's right. the sword. Oh, What's the, really how does cool. the Duel of the Fates go? I, like, I'm, I've like i been trying to remember the, the tune. I literally can't remember it. That one? Yeah. <laughs> this is what the wall comes up. This is what the wall comes up. That's exactly what that is. You know what the wall comes up? And Qui Gon and, and Darth Maul are. Da, da, Qui Gon da, 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 is da, 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 Oh! And Darth Maul just hit him with the. Wow, the, sniped. The, 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 the Swedish sniper earning his reputation. Yeah, he did. He but see, he chucked the sword and now it's no longer Duel of the Fates. Yeah, that's true. He's just melee now. Da, 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 da. Or you, yeah, yeah. So you can't sing the Star Wars song, you just gotta sing the stadium music. Oh, what a. Oh, the spacing! Wow, yeah. He spaced out of the dash attack, uh, the get up attack, which is incredibly hard. Mewtwo King right now looking for a big No hit. jump! Weak hit fair actually does him well there because with the weak hit he can come one to another. This is where Marth, you know, he's got to pick his spacing real yeah. tight because if you get the, the temper forward air, it, it sends it a very different trajectory than the, the weak forward air. And sometimes the weak one's the one you want. Wow, okay. you know what I think I just saw Mewtwo King do? Waited for Armada to pull the turn. Wow, he... Jab! Oh! Oh, does not get the turn? He in. let the turnip fly over him like the biggest badass of all time. You know how, like, in the... I think it was uh, Captain Barbosa and Pirates of the Caribbean, like, the whole mass of the ship falls ah. down, and he just, like, slightly walks forward to get out of the way of it? That was Mewtwo King with that turnip flying at him. Mewtwo King... Oh, and Mewtwo King hunches back in his chair like, ah! Yeah, regular getup from Armada. He was over... Oh, no! Overextension! But it's okay. Yeah, one tipper aerial, I think, either forward air or up air should KO. Oh, interesting choice. That was really strange. I mean, I, you always worry with Peach because Nair comes out so quickly. Yeah, of course he's going to make it back. All right. Oh, okay. Oh. I don't know what you're doing, Mewtwo King, but... Okay. He's oh, looking for something. You know, and, and on this stage, there's... Oh, my... Ha! Oh, wow. You're nuts. Yeah, you are nuts. actually insane, Mewtwo King. That was sick. Let's see. Oh, okay. 
Still though, Armada at 218, are you gonna get it? That was sick by Mujiki. He did the, what's called the baby sit, which is you have to jump out there and you threaten space. So Armada had to fade back more than he really wanted to. Right. And on account of that, he couldn't actually make it back to the stage. Right. Great edge guard by Mujiki, but he's finding himself uncomfortably down right now. Yeah, you don't want to be up in the air against a character like Peach that can juggle well. And uh, and Marth tends to struggle getting down when he's when he's getting juggled up in the air like that. So not the role that Mujiki wanted either. I think just gonna be rough. You know, Armada not the type of player who uh, you can come back on. No, early. Armada just play, when he when he buckles down and plays patient, he's just like this brick wall. Yeah. And, and Mewtwo King really needs, so we talked about buckets a long time ago, like in, in Melee, the stocks are really buckets, and Mewtwo King really needs this bucket. Because yeah, once he he's down to his last stock, all that percent is with him until the end of his, you know, until the end of the game. Right. So it's, it's really, really, really important for Mewtwo King to tack on some additional percent. Uh, I mean, ideally, take this stock before Armada does, right? I mean, ideally, he'll win before... Oh, but... But. Armada kind of throwing that Sitch face away. I feel like that could have been utilized better. Wow, great recovery by Mewtwo. That was precision. Yes. Precision up B to get around the turn of end and grab the ledge. Yeah, precision aerials facing there too. Armada actually floated right above the dash attack right from Marth. Oh, I can't believe that, Ar that Armada didn't nair him. I mean, think one, Peach's nair, I don't actually, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna admit something. I don't know what knockback growth is. People talk about it a lot. I think but I think what it means is that Peach's Nair hits real hard at higher percents. At higher percents, yeah. At lower percents, Forward is a stronger move, but at higher percents, Nair becomes stronger. Nair is... That's going to hit super hard if he gets hit with it at 146. Yeah, it's very powerful, but... Oh! oh! Mewtwo King, big he's, opportunity for he's damage. Stuck, he's oh! oh! Mewtwo King, too smart for everyone. Yeah, including... He, like, triple faked him out. He actually won the Rock, Paper, Scissors, like, three times and then changed his mind. Right, he should have, like, double faked him out, but... He triple faked him it's out, the, but it's, it's he the, got on enough percent. But wait a minute, Armada's in. Armada can there, add. That, that's that, that, you see that aerial height, the, flo the float height? Yeah. Where he's definitely looking for something from Mewtwo King, trying to provoke something out of it's last Last stock. stock, last game. One of these two players will go to the loser's bracket. Mewtwo King really needs to survive the invincibility of Armada, and he does, he does, he does! Oh, oh. my god, Armada now with no jump. What has Mewtwo King got? He fought the perfect float height. You see that above the that border. That was sick, yeah. Mewtwo King coming in with an... And Armada has Nair's been... jab, he's back on the ledge. Mitigating. He's, but he's back. Armada, I've got to say, looks more composed in this moment. Mewtwo King looking a bit impatient, yeah. taking a good bit of damage. And Armada staying in the middle stage. Oh, but... Oh, Slice! Been, but Mewtwo King full jumped, and I don't think he meant to. Not the trade that he wanted. Oh, this might be it. He gets oh, hit with a turn. Oh, he's got the jump, yeah, he's back! He's living, but 115. He needs to make it back on this. Oh, that was. Oh my god. Yeah, oh my god. That back double jump was. He's back! Back in center stage, he gets the grab on Armada. And back to neutral, yeah. yeah Armada turn of bliss. Wow, he's just missed space for the back air. Armada with the fair grab. He's Not enough. King. But one more, one more grab, I think, is going to do it. No! I can't believe that those turnips were still active. Yeah. He failed Did he throw to throw one the up and one forward? How did they hit each other? Did he throw them both up? In any case, great set. Mewtwo King played amazingly. That was one of the closer sets between these two. Uh, that and was, Armada that was clutches it out. I feel like that was a classic. Yeah. That was a timeless set. That is a set that's gonna that's gonna be studied by Marth and Peach players.